close your eyes. Maybe this is where we find out that we're actually witches. I'm scared right now. I'm spooked. My skin's on fire! <laughs> Welcome back to our laboratory. It's Halloween! Yay! Wait, we're supposed to be scary. It's Halloween. Boo. I know that you guys were like, oh my god, aren't they like debunking Disney things? Mm. Oh, look at them in their little glass slippers. No. It's freaking... Halloween, okay? And in this time in our lives, we're like rebelling. Because of that, we have no experts. None. No adults. No medic. Then we might have a medic though. Okay, that's Because good. legally. <laughs> we're doing three little tiny apps where we dive into Halloween films and find out if they're bogus or not. Spooky, spooky. <coughs> you know what one of my favorite ones is? What? Basically, there's this girl, okay? Her name is Sarah. She shows up to this high school as like a newbie. She's like, who should I become friends with? And then she sees these three girls who look like witches, basically. And spoiler alert, they are, okay? So Sarah's like in class one time, and she's like, I'm gonna like do this like pencil thingy. And then the other witches see it, and they're like, yo, you should like join our coven. And she's like, I guess I'll go down with that. Also, they dress really cute. So they're at this like teen witch sleepover, okay? Mm -hmm. Since the pressure to be like an amazing teen witch is like super high, Sarah is like, I'm gonna prove that like I'm a boss witch <laughs> and show you witches how good I am at glamour spells. But then things get super scary. She's putting her hand over this like the pentagram. Thing, pentagram. Yeah, the pentag no, pentagram. No, not pentagon. It's a pentagram. <laughs> so then they're all like, hoo -doo 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 -doo. Hoo -doo -hoo. Yeah. and then she's like, watch this. <laughs> and then, ta-da. She didn't say ta-da. <laughs> well, that would have been cool. Her hair goes from brunette to blonde instantly. And then she went, <laughs> and then went back to brown. No salon, no money. I know this is like magic, but you know what? This is real life. And we're here to find out if it's bogus or not. So how do we do this? I don't know. I already did it. <laughs> oh my oh! God! <laughs> what? What? Why is Jazz here? <laughs> okay, so we've got this thing. All right, let's check this let's out. Let's look at the box. Basically, this not sponsored hair dye um, changes instantly at the touch of any kind of heat. Just a little beep boop hand press, and it should change from smoky gray to invisible. But in the craft, Sarah has brown hair that then goes blonde, which only will work if your hair is already light to then make it dark, because in the movie, she goes from dark to light. So we need blonde hair. Lindsay? Our director's blonde. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Where else can we find blonde hair? We do have a little prop from a couple of episodes ago. Aww. We got some things. Okay, great. Get a little foily. Put some here. <laughs> Should we be like using gloves, gloves and stuff? Let's just okay. do it. Okay, that's like not dangerous. Great. Get the pouty. Hi, welcome to my hair salon. Hey. I'm Chrissy. I've been doing hair for about eight years. Um, I moved here from the Midwest. Put the blow dryer oh. on. Wow. Wow. It's disappearing. Oh my God, never blow dry up, only down. Get rid of the frizz. Oh. All right, so um, we're not gonna put you through the torture of watching us do this strand by strand. So next time you see her, she'll be done. I want a snack. I'm sweating. <laughs> We're in the craft now. We're basically witches because we have a pentagram on a pizza box. Let's get freaking real, okay? We have one mission today, and that's to change brown hair into blonde. Without magic. Well, actually, I was thinking we should try an actual spell. Maybe, like, this is where we find out that we're actually witches. Maybe. Want me to Googs a spell? I think I have one. What? You have a spell? Yeah, I just like... <laughs> Who has a spell? Just in case. Endless moon, pure and fair. Don't laugh. Sorry. <clears throat> what are we summoning? The hair gods. Endless moon, pure and fair. Change the color of her hair. You know, do the thing. Clearly nothing happened. You have to believe more, okay? We're not real witches. Why are you so sad about that? I was hoping this was the moment. Cool, well that's not now. Anyway. 
Here's my smoky gray wig. There's something on it. Ew. That's what I get for putting it on the ground. Wow. Does it look smoky gray? Toes. Yeah. It's not exactly brown, but it's the closest we could find. Basically, your hands are going to change the color of the wig. They said it was supposed to be above 88 degrees. The average human is 98 point... 97 point... What is... 96... Let's do this. Are you sure they're warm enough? All right, we gotta step this up. We gotta do ultra cold and ultra hot. Okay, let's put the wig in the freezer and then warm my hands up or We could like boil your hands. <laughs> it's an idea. Super freezing wig. Lit hands. Super hot hands. Yeah. Lit hands. Lit hands. If anyone's lived in the Midwest, you know about these little bad boys. It's some like crazy chemical reaction that makes them up to 150 degrees. Can I blow dry your hand? Sure. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Boop. Ready? Cool. Beauty, glamour, fashion. No. Can I just like take the hair dryer and put it on your head? Yeah. <laughs> yeah! Is it? Yeah! <laughs> my skin's on fire! Oh, Keep my going, it's for science! It really worked! Oh my god. So now that I'm blonde, we have to do the iconic craft moment and shake it back to brunette. Whoa! All right, let's go back to the lab. Don't forget to turn off all your fake candles on the way out. I'm never wearing that wig again. Uh, I feel like summoning demons drains you a little bit. Is it bogus? It's kind of bogus. Yeah, it's mostly bogus. I don't think hands are like warm enough. You need a freaking hair dryer blasting hot air on your head as you're doing it because technically I'm not hot enough. At least we made a little coven. Oh, that was fun. Boop. Oh my God, uh, my hair is so frizzy. Oh my God, should I get bangs? Uh, no. Should I get bangs? No. I only ride my bike indoors with pumping EDM music. Should I get lip fillers? Who lives in Calabasas? Oh I do. God. I live in Calabasas.